Well, I, th I think that we have to look at fighting corruption in a very holistic manner. There is a question of public education. You know, if you look at the anti-corruption plan, there are three um, strategies. Public education, massive public education on the cost and uh, the evil of corruption, preventive strategies, and then effective investigation and prosecution. So each leg has to be dealt with, you know, proactively. Um, with regard to effective investigation and prosecution, we now have the Office of Special Prosecutor, which is a step in the right direction. And I think we are expecting and hoping that that would increase the level of accountability, you know, which we are going to see, you know, in our body politic. The Special Prosecutor is going to demonstrate that people in high positions can no longer expect to get away with corruption and that they're going to be held accountable. This is my hope and expectation. And I think that um, even the president has indicated that even members of his own political party should not be held immune and that anybody who falls of the law should be held accountable.